Hello and welcome to Great Prime TV. Here we bring you scripture-based prayers. Psalm 102 verse 13 says, Thou shalt arise and have mercy upon Zion. The time to favor her. Yea, the set time is come. Why is it the set time to favor her? Why? Because Zion have discovered a potent way to assess God. And what is that potent way? It is assessing God by his words. Is assessing God by his word. First John 4 says, And this is the confidence that we have in him, that once we ask him of anything according to his will, he heareth us. According to his will. And his will is the scriptures. We hear we pray scriptural prayers. The Bible also says that heaven and earth will pass away, but my word will not pass away. What is his word? His word is that his will. So when we go to the scriptures, we get scriptures based on what we want God to do for us. We pray those scriptures here in this channel. We pray those scriptures and we see God doing wonders in our life. And we see God changing us. And we see God making us love him the more. And we see ourselves getting closer to God. Join us in this prayer and see answers to your prayers. And get answers to your prayer. There is power right now flowing and, and cancelling medical reports, deadly medical reports. Those cases... The doctors have written you off. God is handling it now. The doctors have given you up to die. I command the yoke of infirmity. That terminal disease, cancer, growth, that virus, come out in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. That you be totally whole, made whole, healed in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. Right now be healed. Be healed. In Jesus name. Amen. Amen. Songs of Solomon chapter 2 and verse 4. Hmm. He brought me into the banqueting house. His banner over me, over me was love. Lord by your love. Usher me to my place of celebration. He brought me into the banqueting house. Hey, someone is entering the banqueting house. Someone is entering celebration. Someone is entering celebration. Someone is entering celebration. This December is without disaster. This December shall be the best for you. Someone is entering celebration. God is ushering you to your place of celebration. He's ushering you to the banqueting house. God is ushering you to the banqueting house. He's ushering you to the banqueting house. He's ushering you to the banqueting house. He's usher you to the banqueting house hey usher me to my place lord by your love lord by your love lord by your love usher me to my place of celebration lord by your love usher me to my place of celebration he brought me into the banqueting house for his banner over me was love Lord, by your love, usher me into my place of celebration. Say, my father, my father. My, my father, father, my father. Shout it louder. My, my father, father, my father. In the name of Jesus. In the name of, name of Jesus. Jesus. As I begin to pray. As I begin to pray. Lord, by your love. 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 Usher me to my place of celebration. 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 me to my place of celebration. Usher me to my place of celebration. Lord by your love. 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 Usher me to my place of celebration. 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 Lord by your love. 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 Lord, by your love. Usher me to my place of celebration. 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 Shut up, 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 shut up
Father in the name of Jesus. Father in the name of Jesus. Amen. Father in the name of Jesus. Amen. Father in the name of Jesus. Amen. We come to you today. And we decree that by your love. Usher us. Into the place of celebration. Take us to the place of rest. Take us to the place of jubilation. The place of a new beginning. A turn around. Take us to that place. We decree every little fox in our life. Whatever is inside us spiritually, whatever is around us physically, that you are not happy, you constantly frown out. Father, take it away. Take it away. Take it away. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. There's a sports person who just sprained the ankle. The Lord is healing you right now. There's someone, your last name is Taylor. You are Liberian. You've been having this problem running through the life of your family members. The same evil pattern of not ending well. Today, that yoke is broken from your life and from everyone coming after you in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. I hear a name like Andrew Iromoselli. Andrew Iromoselli. The Lord is showing me something now. 
He said in your family, anytime they get close to something good, something bad happens. And it takes them back to square one. Sometimes they will so go back, they will empty all that they have before they will try to want to come forward again. Something bad will happen. They will go back, empty all they have to want to come in the name of Jesus. That pattern is broken. Amen. Amen. It's broken. Amen. Amen. Paramana Krashta. There's a lady, your name is Pastor Favor. This priest, I should tell you that for everything you have, that for everything you have lost, in the year 2024, it's going to bring double. It's going to make your life beautiful. It's going to give you peace in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. I see a woman, you are watching me from South Africa. You are worried concerning your son. So worried about your son. The Lord said, I should tell you not to worry. Because help is coming. The help that you'll be, you, you break down, so surprised, in tears of joy, a supernatural help that will bring a shift that will change the trajectory of his life is happening right now in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. There's a youth couple watching me, NYSC member. You are sick, very sick. The healing power of God is even affecting your skin. The healing power of God is touching you. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. If you are sick in body, put your left hand on that spot. Si malade, votre main gauche, and stretch your right hand. Main vers moi. I command sickness to go. Je la maladie de partir. Someone is a disease on the neck. A cou. swollen neck like goiter. Et votre cou est gonflé. Dissolve. Que cela se Let the neck come to normal size. Que cela revienne à la normal. Someone has a growth a un tumor. by the side of the ankle. Au niveau, the growth has disappeared. Cela disparaît. There's someone you have an addiction, you inject yourself. Vous avez une addiction, vous It's a injectez. kind of thing you take. If you don't take it, you can't calm down. Si vous ne prenez pas, vous pas à you're addicted to it. Some kind addicted. of pill. You have to inject yourself. Et vous avez, vous avez I command, Je command that addiction. Que cette addiction break in the name of Jesus. Amen. May you be totally free. Que vous soyez totalement libre and healed. Et guéri. In Jesus' name. Amen. 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 Your time has come. Amen. Amen. God bless you. Your prayers are answered. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Let's take our offering right now. Hello, God bless you. Welcome to Wonders Without Number. My time has come. Amen. 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 Your time has come. Amen. The Bible says, Thou shalt arise and have mercy upon Zion. Psalm 102, verse 13. For the time to favor her, yea, the said time has come. So when we say, My time has come, we are calling on mercy and favor to manifest. When you say, My time has come, mercy shows, favor flows. Mercy shows in the name of Jesus. I decree upon your life. Let mercy show. Amen. Let, let favor flow. Amen. I say let mercy show. Let favor flow. Amen. Let mercy show. Let favor flow. Amen. Wonders without number is a prayer platform and an altar of wonders where people are dreamed and tutored in the act of praying and falling in love with the word of God. We are addicts of this world and we love the word of God passionately. Job 23 verse 12 says that I have esteemed the word of your lips than my necessary food. There is power in the word of God. The Bible says in Psalm 138 and verse 2, it says I have exalted my word above all my name. Ecclesiastes 8 verse 4, see where the word of a king is, there is power. In Matthew 24 35, heaven and earth shall pass away, but my word shall not pass away. Hebrews 4 verse 12, the word of God is quick and powerful, sharper than any two-edged sword, piercing to the dividing asunder of the soul and spirit of the joints and marrows, is a discerner of the thought and intents of the heart. In Acts 19 verse 20, so grew mightily the word of God and prevailed. In Hebrews chapter 1 verse 3, God upholds all things by the word of his power. In Proverbs 13, 13, he that despises the word shall be destroyed. There is power in the words of God. There is power in the word of God. I believe as you open up to the word of God today, the power that is inherent in God's word will manifest in your life in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. That you begin to enjoy the fullness of his grace, the fullness of his blessing, the fullness of his promise, the fullness of his unction, the fullness of his spirit in your life. As you begin to 
began both to do and teach. Who is Theophilus? Theos means God. Philos is love. So the word Theophilus is lovers of God. So he was saying, this former treatise have I written to you, O lovers of God, of all that Jesus began both to do and teach. Meaning once you are a God lover, you can do what Jesus did and you can teach what Jesus taught. In the name of Jesus, the grace to love God despite all around you. The grace to love God against all odds. Receive it now in the name of Jesus. Amen. We love you, Jesus. Alleluia. 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 Amen. Alleluia. 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 Amen. Alleluia. 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 Amen. Alleluia. Alleluia. We love you. We love you. Alaba shalama na 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 ba yalama. Alaba lasa. Bregos, just go ahead and worship the King of Kings. Bregos shabala ba na ba na ba na ba shikuru. Braga la ba na ba na ba na ba shikuru. Kala ra na na ba na ba Go ahead and worship the Lord. Rasa 
In Jesus' name. Amen. Somebody say, my time has come. My time has come. If you are watching by television, I want you to call someone and tell them to get seated and tell them if there is a man to pray. There is a God to answer. If there is a man to pray. There is a God to answer. If there is a man to pray. There is a God to answer. And if you are watching online, touch the like button and begin to share the link and share and share. Touch the like button, share the link. And if you are not following us on Celebration TV on Max Air, please follow us today. It's important. It's important that we get to see and you get to hear the word of God on the go. We are still in the month of December, a powerful month with the team that thou mayest prosper. That thou mayest prosper. The plan and purpose of God is for you to prosper. God wants you to prosper. God wants you to prosper. In Psalm 35, 27, he said, let them rejoice that favor my righteous God. Let them sing aloud continually. Let them be, let the Lord be magnified that take pleasure in the prosperity of his saints. The prosperity of his servant. The Bible says in Zechariah 1, 17, that true prosperity shall my cities yet be spread abroad. God wants you to prosper. The plan of God is for you to prosper and not ramification. Prospering under God. Prospering as you walk with God. But the prosperity that we're talking about is, is prosperity that is connected to the prosperity of the soul. It is the prosperity of the soul that determines every other kind of prosperity. According to, to John verse 2, that thou mayest prosper and be net even as thy soul so that's the condition you must be ready for the prosperity of the soul and that originates that simultaneously is what stems and provokes the prosperity of the body and the prosperity financially in the name of jesus you will prosper amen i don't like your amen at all you will prosper amen you will prosper. Amen. Nothing can stop your prosperity. You will prosper. Amen. Your children will prosper. Amen. And make this declaration upon you and in the name of Jesus as you shout amen, you will prosper. Amen. You will prosper. Amen. Your children will prosper. Amen. Your career prosper. Amen. Your profession prosper. Amen. Your seed prosper. Amen. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. The hand of the Lord will help you. 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 The Bible says in Luke chapter 2 verse 16, and it speaks a Bible saying, the ground of a certain man brought forth plentifully. Luke chapter 12 verse 16. Luke 12 16. The ground of a certain man brought forth plentifully. This man was a rich man. Why? His ground brought forth. You are going to pray today. Let the earth favor me. The Bible says the profit of the earth is for all. The king is served by the field. Let the earth favor me. The Bible says in Revelation 12, and the earth helped the woman. Let the earth favor me. Let the earth favor me. Wherever I step on from today, let it favor me. Let the earth favor me. Everywhere I step on, everywhere I go to, everywhere I find myself, let it favor me. Let the earth favor me. Let the earth favor me. You will say this right now. You write it on your page. Let the earth favor me. Write that on your page. Write it on your platform. Let the earth favor me. Let the earth favor me. Let the earth favor me. This ground I step on, favor me. Anywhere I go, favor me. Wherever I find myself, favor me. Let the earth 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 favor me. Write it on your platform. Write it everywhere. Let the earth favor me. 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 
Let the earth favor me. Let the earth favor me. Let the earth favor me. Let the earth favor me. Let the earth favor me. Let the earth number one. Let the earth favor me. Again. 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 Let the earth favor me. 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 Yaka to Yaka Badaba. 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 Yaka Badaba.
Wherever you are praying with me from, I speak to your head, the very earth you walk upon. I command it from today. Bring forth, 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 bring forth in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Let your head bring forth. 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 Hey, as you have opened heavens, may you have opened earth. Let your earth begin to bring forth, bring forth, bring forth, bring forth, bring forth, prosperity, breakthrough, increase, abundance, fruitfulness, multiplication, multiplication, expansion, in the name of Jesus. Amen. Let the earth help you. 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 By the power of the Holy Ghost, let the earth help you. Wherever you are, as you operate under open heavens, may you have profitable and fruitful earth. That the earth will help you massively. Hey, there shall be fruitfulness from now. By the power of the Holy Spirit. The Lord said, I should say to somebody in your house, God is killing a serpent. A serpent that was sent to cause mayhem after you and others in the house that serpent dies that ancient serpent dies in the name of jesus Amen. Amen. Mm. touch the like button and share the link as the lord is doing something great something is happening to somebody's house something is happening to somebody's house something is happening to somebody's house And he said, he thought to himself, saying, What shall I do? Because I have no room where to bestow my fruits. Now we are picking revelations from this prayer. God bless him to a point. In as much as he abused the blessing, that's not our, our focus now. We are picking how God blessed him to a point there was no room. 
The Bible says, good measure, press down, running over. Luke 6, 38. Running over. When you get to the level of running over, the blessing is no more for you. It's beyond you. It's beyond you. There was no more room. Lord, give me the running over experience. Let me experience what it is. It means to have a run over. A blessing that my room enough cannot contain it. That is what God said to Abraham, I will bless you and make you a blessing. Genesis 12 verse 2. More than enough. Give me a run over experience of blessing. Give me a run over experience of blessing. Give me a more than enough room for blessings. Give me Lord, according to this portion. He said, he said, I need more rooms. Give me more than enough rooms for blessings. Blessings that you cannot, you cannot consume in your lifetime. You hand over to your children. They cannot consume. They hand over to their children's children. Give me more than enough room for blessings. 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 More than enough room for blessings. More than enough room for blessings. Say, my father, my father. My father, my father. Shout it louder than that. My father, my father. One more time. My father, my father. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. I begin to pray. As I begin to pray. Give me more than enough room for blessings. 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 Open your mouth and fire blue. So call I'm <laughs> 
your faith to my faith. I connect. Connect your faith to my faith. I connect. Connect your faith to my faith. I connect. May the earth favor you in the name of Jesus. Amen. May the earth favor you in the name of Jesus. Amen. My time has come. Amen. Your time has come. Amen. Our time has come. Amen. The Bible says in Psalm 102 verse 13, Thou shalt arise and have mercy upon Zion for the time to favor her. Yea, the set time is come. I believe God with you today that your time for mercy and your time for favor has come. Yeah, man. And by the power of the Holy Spirit, you begin to walk in the mercy of God. Walk in the favor of God. The Bible says in Romans 9, 15 and 16, I will have mercy on whom I will have mercy. I will have compassion on whom I will have compassion. And verse 16 says, Not of he that will it or run it, but of God that showeth mercy. I believe God in the name of Jesus that the mercy of God, the abundant mercy of God, will be made manifest in your life in the name of Jesus. Amen. And Bartimaeus cried out in Mark 10, 47, Jesus, thou son of David, have mercy on me. In the name of Jesus, mercy will show forth for you. Amen. Say, Jesus, Jesus, thou son of David, thou son of David, have mercy on me. Have mercy on me. Jesus, Jesus, thou son of David, thou son of David, have mercy on me. Have mercy on me. Jesus, 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 thou son of David, 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 thou son of David. Have mercy on me. Have mercy on me. I believe God with you today by the power of the Holy Spirit that the mercy of God will show forth in your life in abundance in the name of Jesus. Amen. The Bible tells us loud and clear that this is the confidence we have when we ask anything in line or according to his will. First John 5 and verse 4. He heard it was the will of God is the word of God. And that is why one that's without number is an altar of wonders and a platform for prayer where people are groomed and tutored in the act of praying and falling in love with the word of God. We are connected to the world. That's our strength. And I believe God with you today that the testimonies that people are having around the world, people saying that they are becoming lovers of God, addicted to the things of God by reason of wonders without number, you will have that same testimony in the name of Jesus. Amen. 
If there is a man to pray, there is a God to answer. If there is a man to pray, there is a God to answer. If there is a man to pray, there is a God to answer. If there is a man to pray, there is a God to answer. If you are watching by television, I want you to get seated and call somebody and tell them there's a man to pray there is a god to answer and if you are watching online touch the like button and begin to share the link share the link until you share it through keep sharing until you share it through god's sword is our base and our strength and our confidence the word of the lord assures us prosperity in psalm 35 27 it says let them be joyful continually and the lord take pleasure in the prosperity of his servants. Zechariah 117 says that true prosperity shall the cities be spread abroad. So God wants you to prosper. The word of the Lord tells us in the book of Luke chapter 9 verse 38, Behold, a man of the company cried out saying, Master, I beseech thee, look upon my son for he is my only child. This man prayed and interceded for his son. Look upon my son is my only child he told jesus this son of his had been bound with an unclean spirit and he cried to god said look upon my son now we are going to pray for our children and those who don't have children you are watching around the world you are not married you don't have children this is the best time to start securing the future of your unborn children anytime prayers are prayed concerning marriage concerning family don't shy away from it the Bible says we are in a generation of calling those things that be not as though they were. You can secure. Just imagine if your parents prayed for you before you were born. How your life would have become. How you would have turned out. Secure them. Don't say I don't have a child yet. Secure them. Secure your son that's coming. Secure your daughter. So that when they come you tell them before you came. I prayed. No one died in the book of First Samuel, I think chapter, chapter 1 or chapter 2. That Hannah said, for this child, I prayed. Hannah was saying, before this child came, I prayed. For this child, I prayed. You are going to pray. So everybody's involved. Both parents, both single. If you're a mother, you're a father, pray for your children. If you're single, pray for your born child secure them so when they come to planet earth they will walk in glory first psalm 127 for this child i prayed and the lord had given before the child was born i prayed we're going to cry out to jesus like the father of that boy look upon my children and help them lord look upon my children and help them lord look upon my children and help them Lord, look upon my children and help them. Your children that are not yet born, God, look upon them ahead of time and help them. Your children that are born, Lord, look upon them and help them. They cannot help themselves. Lord, look upon my children and help them. That's our prayer today. Lord, look upon my children. So nobody, nobody is out of this. Married, single, parent, grandparents great grandparents lord look upon my children and help them you will cry to jesus you will cry to the lamb of god you cry to elohim you cry to yeshua mashiach lord look upon my children and help them 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 Lord, look upon my children and help them. Write this on your platform. Write it everywhere. Lord, look upon my children and help them. Lord, look upon my children and help them. Lord, look upon my children. Number one. Lord, look, Lord, look upon, upon my children, children and help them. Shout it louder. Lord, look upon my children and help them. Shout it louder. Lord, look upon my children and help them. Let the angels of God hear you. Lord, look upon my children and help them. Let the angels of God hear you. Lord, look upon my children and help them. Let the angels of the Lord hear you. Lord, look upon my children and help them. 
La the angels of the Lord hear yeah, you. Lord, look upon my children and help them. Let the angels of God hear yeah, you. Lord, look upon my children and help them. Let the angels of God hear yeah, you. Lord, look upon my children and help them. Let the angels of the Lord hear yeah, you. Lord, look upon my children and help them. Let the angels of the Lord hear yeah, you. Lord, look upon my children and help them. Shout it louder. Lord, look upon my children and help them.
I decree in the name of Jesus, God will help your children. Amen. God will look upon your children and help them. Amen. I see mothers crying because of the, the pain and the travail. You look at your child, there is something about your child that's giving you concern. Right now, may the Lord attend to those concerns in the name of Jesus. Amen. May the Lord attend to those concerns in the name of Jesus. Amen. May the Lord attend to those concerns in the name of Jesus. Amen. That concern over your child, your child's health, your child's academic, your child's marriage, your child's settlement, your child's character, your child's behavior, your child's departure from the ways of God. I decree it's attended to now. Amen. In the name of Jesus, attended to now. Amen. Attended to now. Amen. Attended to now. Amen. May God give you a testimony over your child Amen. and those who are not yet married or have children may God also answer the same prayer for your born children Amen. in the name of Jesus Amen. calling forth those things that be not as though they were as though they were as though they were spirit of God move in the life of these children. Oh Macri Dena no Bada de Gagadiga Gwanda Taparas Esi Parante Pico Tabanka Minon de 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 Zoze Zego de Go de Zoza Dige Zoze Dogaza and Tola Rato Bada Tati Yaratash. In the name of Jesus. Amen. If there's a man to pray, there is a God to answer. One prayer. Touch the like button and begin to share the link now. My God. Is And Jesus said unto them, verse 62 of Luke chapter 9. Jesus said unto him, No man having put his hand on the plow, looking back, looking back, is fit for the kingdom of God. Father, in my life, forward ever, backward never. No man, having put his hand on the plow, looking back, is fit for the kingdom. Lord, in my life, forward ever, backward never. A man said to Jesus, my father is dead. Let me go and bury my father. Jesus said, let the dead bury the dead. And another said something to him. And another said to him, Lord, let me go and bid them farewell, which are at home at my house. And Jesus said, let the dead. Jesus said, no man, having put his hand on the plow, looking back, don't even bid them farewell. In my life, forward ever, backward never, forward ever, backward never. For whatever, backward never. For whatever, say, my father, my father. My father, my father. father. In the name of Jesus. In the name Lord of Jesus. Jesus. As I begin to pray. As I begin to pray. In my life. In my life. For whatever. For whatever. Backward never. Backward never. For whatever. For whatever. Backward never. Backward never. For whatever. For whatever. Backward never. Backward never. For whatever. 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 For whatever, back one never, back one never, for whatever, for whatever, back one never, back one never, for whatever, for whatever, back one never, back one never, for whatever, for whatever, back one never, back one never, for whatever, for whatever, back one never, back one never, for whatever, for whatever, back one never, back one never, for whatever, for whatever, back one never, back one never, for whatever, for whatever, back one never, back one never, for whatever, for whatever, back one never, back one never, for whatever, for whatever, back one never, back one never, for whatever, for whatever, back one never, back one never, for whatever, for whatever, back one never, back one never, for wh
Father, we thank you. We decree, Lord, that you will look upon our children and help them. We decree by the power of your Holy Spirit, by the anointing of your Son, Jesus. We decree that in our lives from this day shall be forward, ever, backward, never. That we shall begin to move like the man Isaac in, uh, in Genesis 26, 13, that the man works great. He went forward and he grew until he became very great. We decree we shall move forward continually. We shall not move backwards in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. We decree the pleasure and the favor and the wisdom and the strength of God. The fortitude of God upon our children. The covering that they are going out, they are coming in is blessed. We come against the powers that silences children at their prime. We come against the works of wickedness. Every child has a concern to the father, a concern to the mother. Whatever spirit is responsible, we bind you in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. Satan, lose your grip and your hold from these children. Those sick be healed, those bound be loose, those down be lifted. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Somebody has a 21-year-old daughter that was initiated to the marine kingdom. And you are aware of it. That child is free now. That child is free. Someone by the name of Angela, you are worried about your son. And his attitude. And how he is. The Lord is changing him. His name is Emmanuel. The Lord is changing him. There's somebody seated on the spot. You can't move. You are incapacitated. Rise up now in the name of Jesus. Amen. I break the power of witch doctors and sangomas from your life. Diviners, astrologers, stargazers, necromancers, soothsayers, their powers are broken from your life. The Lord is arising and is sending you help. The Lord says, I should tell you, supply is coming, supply. He will give you a surprise of supply. In Jesus' name. Amen. If you are sick in body, put your left hand where you have the symptoms. Stretch your hand towards me. I command sickness to go. I command disease to go. I command blood sucking demons to leave your health alone. From your head to your toes, be healed problem of the ribs gone. Le dans les côtes sont Someone has got a virus, God is healing you. Le vous virus. Someone has been healed of a problem in the tongue. Vous êtes guéri de problème de la langue. Be healed. Soyez guéri. In Jesus name. Amen. 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 Jesus. Somebody say, my time has come. My, my time, time has come. come. My time has come. Amen. My time for favor has come. Amen. My time for honor has come. Amen. My time for celebration has come. Amen. And I believe God with you today in the name of Jesus, by the power of the Holy Spirit, that everything you need that makes for life and godliness shall be granted to you in the name of Jesus. Amen. I believe God with you that whatever is a desire of your heart, as we call upon the God that answers by fire, the God that makes all things beautiful in His time, He will reach out to you in the name of Jesus. Amen. And I'm believing God today that the prayer fire, the prayer mantle, the mantle of intercession, the mantle to love the Lord, 
will come upon you in the name of Jesus. Amen. Wonders Without Number is a prayer platform and an altar of wonders where people are groomed and drilled and tutored and raised in the act of praying and falling in love with the word of God. Jeremiah 23, 29, it's not my word like a fire and like a hammer that breaketh the rock in pieces. The possibility of God's word, the practical potency of God's word is being experienced right on this platform. The Bible says, Matthew 24, 35, heaven and earth shall pass away, but my words shall not pass away. The, the potency, the practical possibility and potency of God's word shall be affected in your life today in the name of Jesus. Amen. The Bible says in Acts 19, 20, so grew the word of God and prevailed. So grew the word of God and prevail. So the word of God will prevail in your life. It will prevail in the circumstances where you are find you find yourself now. It will prevail in every ramification, every facet of your life in the name of Jesus. Amen. I want you to know that there is power in the word of God. The Bible says in Hebrews 1 verse 3, he upholds all things by the word of his power. There is power in the word of God. He upholds all things by the word of his power. And I believe God with you today by the power of the Holy Spirit that there shall be a manifestation and a practical demonstration of the power of the Holy Spirit in your life. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Jesus, the son of David, the son of God, I decree you will prosper. Amen. In the name of Jesus, your children will prosper. Amen. In the name of Jesus, your loved ones will prosper. Amen. In the name of Jesus, your spouse will prosper. Amen. In the name of Jesus, your career will prosper. Amen. In the name of Jesus, your profession will prosper. Amen. In the name of Jesus, your work with God will prosper. Amen. I decree today by the power of the Holy Spirit that nothing can stop you. Nothing can stop you. Nothing can stop your children. Nothing can stop your family. Nothing can stop your career. Nothing can stop your profession. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. I'm telling you, we're going to pray today. I'm so excited that the testimonies you are getting, so many. But amongst all the miracles and the manifestation, whenever I hear somebody say, I now pray like never before. I now love God. I now love the word. It just rings a bell inside of me that we are actually in tandem and in line and in sync with that which the Lord instructed us to do. To make people love God. That's all. That's all. To make people love God. Just to make people love God. To make people ignore what they are going through. To make people follow God, not on a transactional level. Just love him. Love him. Love him. The Bible says in Luke chapter 13, verse 12. When Jesus saw her, he called her to him and said to her, Woman, thou art loosed from thy infirmity. I am loosed from infirmity. I am loosed from infirmity. This woman was bowed together. So infirmity is that thing that keeps you on the floor. Infirmity is that thing that puts your head down. Infirmity is that thing that stops you from lifting up your head to stand amongst the community of men. Infirmity is a restriction, a limitation. The word sickness, disease. Disease is anything that takes away your ease. Whatever makes life uneasy is disease. She was bowed together. The Bible says, and Jesus said, Ought not this woman be loosed? I am loosed from infirmity. When you say I'm loosed from infirmity, you are saying you are loosed from every limitation, every restriction. Whatever has stopped and quarantined you to a spot, I am loosed from infirmity. 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 I am loosed. Loose. You are going to cry out to the Lord. You are going to scream out loud and clear. Loud and very clear. I am loose from infirmity. 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 
I am loose from infirmity. I am loose from infirmity. I am loose from infirmity. I am loose from infirmity. I am loose from infirmity. I am loose from infirmity. I am loose from infirmity. I am loose from infirmity. I am loose from infirmity. I am loose from infirmity. I am loose from infirmity. You will lift your voice and scream it loud and clear. And let the Lord hear your voice loud and clear. Loud and clear. I am loose. Write it on your page. Write it on your platform. Write it everywhere. I am loose from infirmity. I am loose from infirmity. Number one. I am loose from infirmity. Shout it louder. I am loose from infirmity. By the power of the Holy Ghost. I am loose from infirmity. By the force of grace. I am loose from infirmity. By the Spirit of God. I am loose from infirmity. By the power of Jesus. I am loose from infirmity. By the power of Jesus. I am loose from infirmity. By the power of Christ. I am loose from infirmity. By the power of Christ. I am loose from infirmity. By the power of Christ. I am I am loose from infirmity. By the power of Christ. I am loose from infirmity. By the power of Christ. I am loose from infirmity. By the power of Christ. I am loose from infirmity. By the power of Jesus. I am loose from infirmity. By the power of Jesus. I am loose from infirmity. By the power of Jesus. I am loose from infirmity. By the power of Jesus. I am loose from infirmity. By the power of Jesus. I am loose from infirmity. By the power of Jesus. I am loose from infirmity. By the power of Jesus. I am loose from infirmity. By the power of Jesus. I am loose from infirmity. By the power of Jesus. I am loose from infirmity. By the power of Jesus. I am loose from infirmity. By the power of Jesus. I am loose from infirmity. By the power of Jesus. I am loose from infirmity. By the power of Jesus. I am loose from infirmity. By the power of Jesus. I am loose from infirmity. By the power of Jesus. I am loose from infirmity. By the power of Jesus. I am loose from infirmity. By the power of Jesus. I am loose from infirmity.
Spirit, that you are loose from infirmity in the name of Jesus. Amen. I say you are loose from infirmity in the name of Jesus. Amen. You are loose from infirmity in the name of Jesus. Amen. You are loose from infirmity in the name of Jesus. Amen. Now this is strange. I see somebody in the realms of the spirit. There is a nest, N E S T, that's been built on your head. This attack you are seeing now is demonic birds coming to perch on your head. And it happens towards the end of the month and it is terrible. It's like your head is almost pulling off. That's the physical manifestation. But the spiritual manifestation is I saw when we were praying a nest on your head that birds spiritually come to perch on that nest and it affects your head literally. Sometimes they will have to hold your head. Sometimes they have to tie it. Sometimes they have to keep pouring water. Sometimes you've been to the hospital. Every month end is a crisis. Today, I set the nest on fire and I command it disappear in the name of Jesus. Amen. Someone, every three months, your legs just get swollen. Swollen for a whole month, you stay at home. So, a whole month, you'll be at home. You manage yourself for three months, another one full month because of the attacks, the periodical attacks on your legs. Whatever that represents in the realms of the spirit, I nullify it in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. Somebody say, I am loose from infirmity. 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 Look at what the Bible says here. In verse 13, and he laid his hands on her. And immediately she was made straight and glorified God. Lord, lay your hands on me. Lord Jesus, 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 you cried louder than that. Say, my father, my father. My father, my father. Shout it louder than that. My father, my father. Whatever you are watching for, touch the like button and begin to share the link. Please touch the like button now. Everyone watching, go ahead immediately. Touch the like button. Don't waste time. Don't waste time. Do it at this moment. Do it at this moment. Do it at this moment. Touch the like button. Everybody begin to touch it. Touch the like button. Touch the like button and begin to share the link. Touch the like button and begin to share the link. Touch the like button. Do that now and begin to share the link. Do that. Do that. Do that. Do that. Touch the like button and share the link. Everyone, 
Touch the like button, everyone, and share the link. Share the link. Say, Lord Jesus. Lord Jesus. Lay your hands on me. Lay your hands on me. Say, my father, my father. My father, my father. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. As I begin to pray. As I begin to pray. Lord Jesus. Lord Jesus. Lord Jesus. Lord Jesus. Lord Jesus. Lord Jesus. Lay your hands on me. Lay your hands on me. Open your mouth and fire prayer. Da 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 da
Father, we thank you. We want to say how much we love you. We want to say how much we love you. Thank you, Lord, for the answers to our prayers. Thank you, Lord, for showing yourself strong on our behalf. We say thank you. We say thank you. We say thank you. We say thank you, Lord. We say thank you. You have answered our prayers. You have shown us great mercy. We say thank you, Lord. We say thank you. You have met all our needs. You have granted our desires, Lord. We say thank you. We say thank you. Father, we are loose from infirmity in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. I decree as you hear the sound of my voice, connect your faith to my faith. I connect. By the power of the Holy Spirit, may the Almighty God lay his hands on you in the name of Jesus. Amen. May the hand of God be laid on your life, on your children, on your interests, your investment, all that God has called you to do, all that God has created you to be. May God lay his hands on you to fulfill them. May God lay his hands on you in the very places and spots and areas of your life where you have given up. May God turn your life around and give you a testimony. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. I speak the grace of God upon you. I hear Cindy. Oji. The Lord says I should tell you. The past couple of years in your life, there have been so much losses. But this is what the Almighty God says to tell you. That we feel the vacuum in your life. It will complete you and restore the years that have been lost. And it will give you a testimony that will make you the voice in your family line. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. I see a man who has got a problem with one side. You don't, you, when you sleep, you, you maintain one side. You can't use the other side because your ribs, as it were, are on fire if you try to do it. So they are giving you drugs to be able to manage it. But God is healing you now. I hear a certain Joshua McDonald's. This is what the Lord said to tell you. He said, The hand of God is upon you, the mandate of God is upon you. But say, I should tell you that He wants to amplify your voice. There are altars and foundational struggles down your father's family. It has caught up with a lot of people, it has swallowed them up before their time. He said, But for you, I should tell you that those evil altars. You will surmount them. I see God putting on you royalty, royalty, like uh, pearls, diamond, almond, gold, silver. So the Lord says that royalty is your portion. You will appear before great people in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. I see somebody by the name of Bibiana. They took your child from you, your child. I don't know what happened, but the Lord is bringing the child back. Give you access back to your child in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. I speak a blessing upon you all. 
in Jesus name. Amen. Amen. You are sick in body, put your left hand on that spot. Si in vous êtes malade, mettez votre main gauche. I command sickness to go. Je commande la maladie de partir. Towards me. I command disease to go. Et les autres maladies de partir. I rebuke cancer. Je reprimande le cancer. I rebuke tumor. Les tumeurs. I rebuke fibroids. Les fibromes. I rebuke HIV. Les VIH. I rebuke every virus. Je reprimande tout virus. Every infection. Les infections. Come out in the name of Jesus. Sortez dans le nom de Jésus. I decree be totally healed. Vous êtes guéri totalement. Be made whole. Soyez guéri complètement. Be made whole. Soyez guéri complètement. From your head to your toes. De la tête jusqu'aux pieds. Somebody who got a problem with your spinal cord, God is healing you. Le Seigneur vous guérit des problèmes de bonne santé. There's a footballer who has a terrible knee injury. Il y a un footballeur qui a des problèmes de genou. God has healed you. Le Seigneur vient de vous guérir. There is somebody you are a black belt. You are into um, martial arts. Il y a quelqu'un qui est dans les arts martiaux. You got this, your bone got dislocated in one of your training sessions. Votre os est dislocé. Le Seigneur vous guérit. Everyone be healed. Toute personne soyez guéri. In Jesus name. Dans Amen. Le nom de Jésus. Amen. The Lord bless you as you pray with us. May your grand our desires be granted. We're not going to take our offerings. No. My time has come. Amen. Amen. We love the Lord. We thank him for keeping us alive and well. We thank the Lord for keeping us alive. We thank him for his grace and his mercies that are bound and are new every morning. We thank him for the gift of life. We thank him for the breath. We thank him for keeping us alive. We thank him for keeping our family. Lord, we thank you. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Welcome to Wonders Without Number. My time has come. Amen. Somebody say it seven times. My time has come. Number one. My time has come. Say it again. 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 My time has come. The Bible says in Psalm 102, verse 13, Thou shalt arise and have mercy upon Zion for the time to favor her. Yea, the set time is come. And I believe God that your set time for the miracle, your set time for the breakthrough has come, your set time for the testimony, your set time for the move of God has come. I believe God with you. Without any shadow of doubt, I believe God that whatever has caused you unrest today shall be laid to rest. Amen. I believe your amen. Whatever has caused you unrest today shall be laid to rest. Amen. Whatever has stolen your rest and peace today shall rest in pieces. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. The blessings of God will abound in your life. The tangible, visible, seeable, touchable, feelable, noticeable blessings of God will abound in your life greatly that you begin to enjoy the promises of the Father, the promise of the Holy Spirit in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. That great things will begin to happen in your life. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Wonders Without Number is an altar of wonders and a prayer platform where people are groomed and tutored and raised in the act of praying and getting addicted to scripture. If you get it right with scripture, you get it right in your walk with God. Nothing pilots your walk with God effectively like your addiction to scriptures. Nothing pilots your walk with God effectively like scriptural addiction. Not just addiction, scriptural applications. When you see the word of God and you study it, you apply it and you begin to get uncommon and outstanding results. When these results begin to manifest in your life, it becomes profiting before all. In the name of Jesus, receive that grace right now. Amen. If you are watching by television, I want to call somebody and get the person seated and tell the person that one that's without numbers on the air. And tell the person, if there is a man to pray, there is a God to answer. If there is a man to pray, there is a God to answer. If there is a man to pray, there is a God to answer. If there is a man to pray, there is a God to answer. If you are watching online, touch the like button and begin to share the link and do what you share and share through. That thou mayest prosper. That thou mayest prosper. That thou mayest prosper. Psalm 35, 24 tells us that God takes pleasure in the prosperity of his servant. He takes pleasure. So if, if, if the prosperity of his servant gives him pleasure, it means their poverty, their lack gives him displeasure. 
you see, gives him this pleasure. So God takes pleasure. What is prosperity? Prosperity is all around blessings. The blessings of God upon your life. And in the kingdom, the prosperity that God wants to give us is a prosperity that is connected to the prosperity of the soul. Your prosperity in this life is on the platform of your soulish prosperity. Third John verse 2 says, I wish above all things that thou mayest prosper and be in health even as thy soul prospereth. Be in health. Many of you will notice as you are entering next year, you shall be in health in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. That constant off and on attack on your body ends today in the name of Jesus. Amen. Say, I shall be in health. 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 In the name of Jesus. Amen. So shall it be. So shall it be. We have a prayer today from Luke 15. We are going to pray and call upon the Lord. And we believe he's going to answer us by fire. And we answer us. We bless your name. Thank you, my father. In Jesus' name we worship. Amen. Luke chapter 15, verse 13. And not many days after, the younger son gathered all together and took his journey into a far country and there wasted his substance in riot with riotous living. Wasted his substance. There's so much God has deposited inside of you. We pray this prayer. May I not waste heaven's investment in my life. May I not waste heaven's investment in my life. God has given you talent and gifts and ability, money and time and education, intellect. But today the enemy has invaded into our lives like the prodigal son. Making us feel there is something outside God. There is nothing outside God. There is no life outside God. There is no life outside God. You will pray. May I not waste heaven's investment in my life. May I not waste heaven's investment in my life. May I not waste heaven's investment in my life. May I not waste heaven's investment. Write this down. This is a very important, a most important prayer. May I not waste heaven's investment. Touch the like button even as you share the link. May I not waste heaven's investment in my life. May I not waste heaven's investment in my life. May I not waste heaven's investment in my life. May I not waste heaven's investment in my life. May I not waste heaven's investment in my life. May I not waste heaven's investment in my life. May I not waste heaven's investment in my life. May I not waste heaven's investment in my life. May I not waste heaven's investment in my life. May I not waste heaven's investment in my life. May I not waste heaven's investment in my life. May I not waste heaven's investment in my life. May I not waste heaven's investment in my life. May I not waste heaven's investment in my life. May I not write it on your platform or your page. Write it now so that every day it can stand there as a prophetic declaration. It has become a written prophecy that you will not waste heaven's investment in your life. The investment of heaven in your life will not be wasted. Whether it is gift, talents, and abilities, whether it is a job, a profession, a career, a platform, you will not waste it. God will not feel grieved for elevating you. You will cry that cry to God. May I not waste heaven's investment in my life. Number one. May I not waste heaven's investment in my life. Shout it again. May I not waste heaven's investment in my life. Shout again. May I not waste heaven's investment in my life. Shout again. May I not waste heaven's investment in my life. Shout again. May I not waste heaven's investment in my life. Shout again. May I not waste heaven's investment in my life. Shout again. May I not waste heaven's investment in my life. May I not waste heaven investment in my life. May I not waste heaven investment in my life. May I not waste heaven investment in my life. May I not waste heaven investment in my life.
investment in my life. May I not waste heaven investment in my life. May I not waste heaven investment in my life. May I not waste heaven investment in my life. May I not waste heaven investment in my life. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, 
I decree upon your life as you hear the sound of my voice in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ you will not waste heaven's investment on your life Amen. Amen. in the name of Jesus you will not waste heaven's investment on your life Amen. Amen. in the name of Jesus you will not waste heaven's investment on your life Amen. Amen. investment of heaven on your life wisdom talent gifts ability money time uh, connection contact I decree will not be wasted in the name of Jesus Amen. I decree that this investment will make heaven proud we make God proud of you Holy Spirit do it Holy Spirit do it in our lives that investment of God in our life will not be a waste and heaven will be proud of us when you look from heaven at these investments your heart will be pleased be it time be it intellect, ideas, vision, gifting, talents, abilities, insight, depth. It's all investment that you gave us for the profiting of the kingdom. Help us. Help us. To profit with her. And that the name of the Lord be glorified. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. If there's a man to pray, there, there is, is a God, God to answer. answer. If there's a man to pray, there, there is a God, God to answer. answer. If there's a man to pray, there, there is a God, God to answer. answer. In Luke, still in chapter 15, verse 15, he went and joined himself to a citizen of that country. That country. And they sent him into the fields to feed swine. Lord, restrain me from ungodly connections. Lord, restrain me. Sometimes you must understand that God wants you to move with the right people. People that will add value. Proverbs 13 verse 20 says, He that walketh with the wise shall be wise, but a companion of fools shall be destroyed. God wants you to be with the right people. Restrain me, Lord, from ungodly connections. Lord, restrain me any connection that is ungodly, restrain me. May the zeal to attach myself to such people die. May the zeal to attach myself to such contacts die. Restrain me from ungodly connections. You will cry to God. You will cry to the Lamb of God. You will cry to the ancient of days. You will cry to the great I am. You will cry to the El Shaddai. The lion of Judah's tribe, you will cry. You will lift your voice and cry. Restrain me from ungodly connections. You will lift your voice and you will cry. Restrain me from ungodly connections. 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 Restrain me. Write that down. Restrain me from. Say, my father, my father. My father, my father. Shout it louder. My father, my father. Shout it louder. My father, my father. Shout it louder. My father, my father. Shout it again. My father, my father. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. As I begin to pray. As I begin to pray. Restrain me. Restrain me. From ungodly connection. From ungodly connection. Restrain me. Restrain me. From ungodly connection. From ungodly connection. Restrain me. Restrain me. From ungodly connection. From ungodly connection. Restrain me. Restrain me. From ungodly connection. From ungodly connection. Ratuba Maxi. Ruta 
Jesus name. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. I say in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. Connect your faith to my faith. I, I connect. I decree today the grace to maintain, retain the investment of heaven in your life rest upon you in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. I decree by the power of the Holy Spirit every ungodly connection, ungodly contact you find yourself in already that is sapping your spiritual strength. That is snuffing out the supernatural life that God has given to you. That is, that is making your light to dwindle. That is affecting the brightness of your star. That is making you recede to hell. Recede backwards. That is killing your love for God. Making you lukewarm. The Lord break it from that connection. Amen. Amen. The Lord break it from that connection. Amen. The Lord break it from that connection. Amen. May the Lord give you connections that will inspire you. We make you love God. Love him. And love him. And love him. I see somebody. You were born on the 4th of July. Your life has been in a mess as it were. And you are, you, are, you are willing and crying to God. You've taken out some time to pray. That God, please put my life together. God says, I should tell you. That in the next couple of days, something heavy is coming. Something big. Something great. And this will become a tether out in your entire life. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. Ashu. Morin. Morin Ashu. I see two people pulling you. One on the left, one on the right. There's like a contest. I don't know what is happening. In the midst of two people, these two people are contending as vowed that your life is going to be a battleground. Today, let the ground open and swallow them. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. I don't know who you are. There, are. there are 73 people. The Lord says I should tell you that his light will shine in your life. His light will shine in your life. Someone is being delivered from a serpent. That serpent dies now. May the Lord arise and give you a testimony. A woman has children. And all the children, about five of them, are plagued with one attack to the other. But God has healed the five of them now in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. We call it done in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. If you are sick, anybody, si vous êtes malade, place your left hand on that. Mettez la main gauche là. Where you are hurting. Là vous avez des problèmes. And stretch your hand to me. Étendez l'autre main vers moi. I command sickness to go. Je commande la maladie de partir. I command disease to go. Les afflictions de partir. I command affliction to go. Les afflictions de partir. From the crown of your head. De la tête. To the sole of your feet. Jusqu'à vos pieds. Be made whole. Soyez guéri. Be made whole. Soyez guéri. Be made whole. Soyez guéri. In the name of Jesus Christ. Dans le Amen. nom de Jésus. It is well with you. Tout va bien avec vous. In Jesus name. Amen. Amen. The Lord bless you. We we'll take our offerings. Your time has come. Amen. Our time has come. Amen. We are grateful to God for the testimonies he's bringing our way and the miracles that are happening in the lives of thousands and thousands and millions of people around the world. And we are praying that these testimonies will abound and will continue to multiply in the name of Jesus. Amen. I believe God with you today is a new week. We are entering our believing God for great grace that this week promises under God to be most profound, most powerful, most outstanding. I believe God with you today that everything that is a desire in your heart, the Holy Spirit will grant them, the Lord Jesus will meet them, and the power of God will effect them 
and it will come to pass speedily in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. Wonders without number is a prayer platform and an altar of wonders where people are groomed, drilled, tutored, and raised in the art of praying and falling in love with the words of God. There is power in the word of God. There is power in the word of God. Proverbs 13, 13, he that despises the word shall be destroyed. There is power in the word of God. He that despises the word shall be destroyed. That's what the word of the Lord says. I believe in the power of God's word. Hebrews 4, 12, the word of God is quick and powerful, sharper than any two-edged sword, piercing to the dividing asunder of the soul and spirit, of the joints and marrows, and is a descender of the thoughts, and the intents of the heart. There is power in the word of God. Jeremiah 15, 16, that word were found, I did eat them, and they became a rejoicing unto my soul. I'm called by the name, O Lord of hosts. I believe God today that by the power of the word of God that will be effected in your life. Anything that you desire of the Lord, any desire, any heart cry, I decree in the name of Jesus, it shall be met. Amen. 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 Heart cry concerning your children. And make this prophetic declaration. Heart cry concerning your children. Heart cry concerning your loved ones. Heart cry concerning your home. Heart cry concerning your investments, your career, your job. In the name of Jesus, it shall be met. Amen. All right. If you are watching by television, I want to get seated and tell somebody if there is a man to pray. There is a God to answer. If there is a man to pray. There is a God to answer. If there is a man to pray. There is a God to answer. If there is a man to pray. There is a God to answer. If there is a man to pray. There is a God to answer. If there is a man to pray. There is a God to answer. If there is a man to pray. There is a God to answer. If you are watching online, touch the like button and begin to share the link. Share the link until you share and share and share through. Father, we thank you. Go ahead and worship the Lord today. Worship the Lamb of God. And we worship you, Lord. We give you all the glory, all the praise, all the honor, all adoration. We worship you. 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 In Jesus' name. I decree upon your life in the name of Jesus anything missing in your life whatever needs to be in your life to give your life color to give your life relevance to give your life a meaning to give your life a footing to give your life balance to give your life a, a, a flavor to give your life glamour whatever you need in your life that will beautify your life and is currently and presently not there I decree in the name of Jesus, it is released now. Amen. It is released now. Amen. May your life become colorful. Your life become bright. Your life receive illumination. And I decree in the name of Jesus, nothing lacking, nothing broken. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Nothing lacking, nothing broken in the name of Jesus. Amen. Nothing lacking, nothing broken in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. I don't know why the Lord is telling me this. He said, I should say to a family, the premature death that killed your father, that killed your uncles that has been a pattern in the family that people die premature in the name of jesus because you are praying with me today by the force of grace anyone who is standing as a strong man to maintain that altar to service that altar may that altar take that person now Amen. the yoke of premature untimely death is broken in the name of jesus Amen. Ah, yeah 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 it's broken in the name of jesus Amen. i see a young lady by the name of stella you are watching right now there's a, a, a marital delay in your in your family the only thing that people do is that they give birth to children but they cannot have a legal marriage and you've been trying to be different but you had several disappointments and you love to settle 
Right now, God said, I should tell you, let a miracle hit you. Let the one that God has ordained for you manifest and show forth. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. I call it forth. 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 In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. If there's a man to pray, there is a God to answer. If there's a man to pray, there is a God to answer. If there's a man to pray, there is a God to answer. If there's a man to pray, there is a God to answer. Touch the like button if you're not following us on C on uh, uh, Michel Arrow. Follow us if you're not following us on Ostgram. Please follow us on Ostgram. Follow us on Ostgram. Follow us on Ostgram. Follow us on Michel Arrow and follow us on Ostgram. If you're not following us on Ostgram, it's very very important. Jeremiah chapter thirty verse seventeen. I will restore health unto thee. Say amen. Amen. I will heal thee of thy wounds. Amen. Say the Lord. Because they called thee an outcast, said, saying, This is Zion, whom no man seeketh after. I want to pick that scripture, that phrase, I will heal thee of thy wounds. What is that thing that you're nursing, that pain, that injury? Something happened. You find it hard to be healed. You find it hard to be consoled. God said, I should tell you, it will heal you of your womb. In the name of Jesus, it will heal you of your womb. What happened? Is it marriage? Is it ministry? Is it finances? Is it your business? Is it your home? I will heal you of thy wounds. God says today, it will heal you of your wounds. In the name of Jesus, it will heal you of your wounds. You pray, Lord, heal me of my wounds. Lord, heal me. Write it down on your platform, on your page. Write it, Lord, heal me of my wounds. 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 He said, I will heal thee of thy wounds. Lord, heal me of my 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 wounds. Write that down on your page. Write it on your platform. Write it everywhere. Lord, heal me of my wounds. 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 Write it down your platform and hashtag wonders with a number. Lord, heal me. Write it everywhere. Everywhere. Go on IG. Write it. Facebook. Write it. YouTube. Write it. Go on Twitter. Write it. Write it everywhere. Everywhere, Lord, heal me of my wounds. Lord, heal me of my wounds. Lord, heal me of my wounds. Number one. Lord, heal me of my wounds. Shout again. 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 Lord, heal me of my wounds. Ragada, ragada,
There's a young, a young chap, you're a Muslim, your name is Ali, and you have been having encounters with God, and you have been wondering, what are these dreams? You're having encounters, strong encounters with God, because God wants to use you mightily. But there's a connection to the water world, a man-made power that has clung on to you today. It breaks in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. May you encounter the Lord Jesus and know him for yourself. May you receive him as your Lord and your master. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. The Lord says he's healing somebody by the name of Helen. With pains on the side. God is healing you now. God is healing you now. God is healing you now. And I decree everyone who is not seen an injury a wound. That when you think about what happened, it's fresh in your mind. And you are hurting. I decree by the power of the Holy Spirit. The Lord says I should tell you something that would gladden your heart is about to happen in the name of Jesus. Amen. He will give you something that will gladden your heart. Hey, you have been wounded. Wounded by friends, colleagues, relatives, family members. The Lord is healing your heart right now in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ Amen. God is healing your heart I don't know the stories you have carried the stories you have carried on the way you have been treated by people God is healing your heart in the name of Jesus Amen. if there's a man to pray there is a God to answer if there's a man to pray there is a God to answer if there's a man to pray there is a God to answer verse 19 out of them shall proceed thanksgiving. The voice of them that make merry, I will multiply them, they shall not be few. I will glorify them, they shall, they shall not be small. You see, from them shall proceed thanksgiving. Multiply them, not few. Glorify them, not small. God wants to change your story in both sides. And everything you do give me a total turnaround oh lord arise give me a total turnaround you will pray that prayer for yourself for your family oh lord arise give me a total turnaround 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 Oh Lord arise, give me a total turn around. Oh Lord arise, give me a total turn around. Oh Lord arise, give me a total turn around. Oh Lord arise, give me a total turn around. Oh Lord, say my father, my father. My father, my father. Shout it louder. My father, my father. Shout it two more times. My father, my father. Shout it one more time. My father, my father. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. As I begin to pray. As I begin to pray. Oh Lord arise 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 Give me a total turn around Give me a total turn around Oh Lord arise 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 Give me a total turn around 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 Open your mouth and fire please Shut the neck of the 
Connect your faith to my faith. I connect. Wherever you hear the sound of my voice, I pray for you. And I decree by the power of the Holy Ghost, may God heal your wounds now. Amen. May God heal your wounds now. Amen. Somebody has a brother called George. He's in jail. The Lord is setting him free now. He's being released. He's being set free by the power of the Holy Spirit in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. Someone has an organization or this is a business. I guess something like Tarius. That's why you name the name. You name the business after Tarius. The Lord said, I should tell you that whatever attack was fired to that business, the Lord is putting an end to it. That business begins to flourish again in the name of Jesus. Amen. Kola Manasaradash. God says, I should pray for parent. Parent. P E R E Y. That's what I see. The Lord says, I should tell you that something good is coming soon. And you will not be alone. You will not be able to handle it alone. Because of the blessings that God is bringing in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. I hear a name like Susan Egbune. Susan Egbune. The Lord says, I should tell him to get ready because celebration is coming to your house. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. I decree that the Lord give you a total turnaround. A total turnaround in your marriage. A total turnaround in your home, in your business, in your family. In the name of the Lord Jesus. Amen. You are sick in body. Put your left hand on that spot. Si vous êtes malade, mettez votre main gauche. I come against sickness. Je viens contre les maladies. That has plagued you. Et qui vous a joué. I command you to come out now. Je commande de sortir. Whatever is not of God. Tout ce qui n'est pas de Dieu. In your body. Dans votre corps. Come out now. Sort maintenant. Anything missing in your body. Tout ce qui manque dans votre that corps. That you need in your body. Dont vous avez besoin. That you need in your kidney. Dont vous avez besoin. De... That you need in your mind. Dans, dans votre pensée. That you need in your skin. Dans Receive it now in the name of Jesus. Amen. May the healing power of God touch you from your head to your toes. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. The Lord bless you and keep you and honor you in the name of Jesus. Amen. Let's take our offerings right now. Oh, God bless you. Welcome to one that's without number. My time has come. Amen. My time has come. Amen. I am super grateful, super excited to God for what He's doing in your life. All the testimonies that you are sending to us and the mind-blowing transformation in your work with God. That's our ultimate. That is why we are here. People are testifying that their work with God is now colorful. It's now bright. There's proximity. They now command that ambience of God. And like I say on this platform, you are God's headquarters. And I believe God with you today. If you are just joining us for the first time, or this is your first week or first month with us, or maybe just for one or two months, and you're joining us, I want you to know that the mantle to pray, the grace to pray, will come upon you. We are commissioned to pray. Prayer is not an advice. It's a command. Men ought always to pray and not to faint. Luke 18 verse 1. Men ought always, men, 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 not people, not everyone. Men, men, men ought always. So those that pray always are men. Those that pray always are men. 
they are grown, they are matured. Men ought always. So men is men that pray. Men don't complain. Men don't murmur. When they have a burden in their heart, they take it to prayers. When they have a desire, they take it to prayers. When they have a need, they take it to prayers. When they have a confusion in their mind, they take it to prayers. That is how you know you are growing and growing in the Lord. Welcome. My time has come. Amen. 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 Whenever we say my time has come, we're connecting to Psalm 102, verse 13. Thou shalt arise and have mercy upon Zion for the time to favor her. Yea, the said time is come. The time for mercy. The time. Whenever you say my time has come, you are attracting two, two components. Mercy and favor. Mercy and favor. Mercy shows, favor flows. Whenever you say my time has come, mercy shows, favor flows. That thou mayest prosper. That thou mayest prosper. That thou mayest prosper. In the name of Jesus, I breathe this prophecy into your life. I breathe this prophecy into the life of your children. I breathe this prophecy into your family. I breathe this prophecy into your career. I breathe this prophecy into your organization. You will prosper. Amen. I can hear you. You will prosper. Amen. 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 Anything that your hand finds. Tomorrow, by the help of God, I want you to hold the works of your hand. What is that thing that you do? Hold it tomorrow. Get something to represent what you do tomorrow. Tomorrow. Get something to represent what you do. You are going to keep it as we are praying. Because I'm going to pray on it that the Lord, through the works of your hand, will prosper you. I said the Lord will prosper you. Amen. 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 Will prosper you. Amen. You will hold it tomorrow. Whatever you do, whatever the works of your hands are, you will hold it and God will bless the work of your hands. The Lord will bless the work of your hands. The Lord will bless the works of your hands. The Lord will bless the works of your hands. The Lord will bless the works of your hands. The Lord will bless the works of your hands. In the name of Jesus. Wonders Without Number is a prayer platform and an altar of wonders where people are groomed and tutored and drilled and schooled in the act of praying and falling in love with the word of God. The word of God is powerful. We fall in love with the word of God on this platform. The word of God becomes meaning, becomes life to us, becomes effective to us, becomes powerful to us as we open up our heart to it. And I believe God with you. As you open up your, your mind, your hearts, the illumination and the light of God's incomprehensible word, God's indefatigable, infallible word, indisputable, incontestable, impregnable word, will show forth its light and bring forth results, undeniable results in your life, in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. If there's a man to pray, there is a God to answer. If you are watching right now on television, tell somebody if there's a man to pray, there is a God to answer. If there's a man to pray, there is a God to answer. If there's a man to pray, there is a God to answer. If there's a man to pray, there is a God to answer. If there's a man to pray, there is a God to answer. If there's a man to pray, there is a God to answer. If you are watching online, touch the like button, begin to share the link, share and share and share and share until you are able to share through. Keep sharing, keep sharing, don't stop sharing until you share through. But touch the like button now, touch the like button and share the link as we begin to pray. As we begin to call upon the Lord, as we 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 come, there's someone, you're a lady, you had to cut your hair because of what is happening. The kind of pain and aches you feel, so you had to cut the hair. You have to cut it literally. Cut your hair. Whatever is walking and moving around the hair, causing you so much discomfort and pain, like a serpent. Today, it dies in the name of Jesus. Amen. May the hand of the heaven be extended to you. And the mercy of God come upon you right now. And God heal you. That you be made whole and healed and free and set free transformed be healed right now 
the God of heaven heal you. In Jesus' name. Amen. Somebody say, my time has come. My time has come. In Songs of Solomon, chapter 2 and verse 15, it says, take ox the foxes, the little foxes that spoil the vines. For our vines have tender grapes, little foxes. Lord, deliver me from little foxes. There are things in your life that are contending your prayers. Sometimes your character is louder than your voice. Your attitude might be louder than your prayers. Little foxes, what is that thing in your life that God is not happy about? Lord, take it away. What is that thing in your life that God is not happy? Take it away! Right now. In Galatians chapter 5 and verse 9, it says, A little leaven, leaven the whole lot. You see, apostle, it's a very little thing. How little is little? How little is little? A little leaven, a little stain, levels. Lord, deliver me from little foxes. Lord, deliver me from little foxes. Deliver me from the little foxes that spoil the vine. Deliver me from the little foxes. Write that down on your page. Write on your platform. Write everywhere. Deliver me from little foxes. Deliver me from the little foxes. Deliver me from the little foxes. Deliver me from the little foxes, Lord. Deliver me from the little foxes. 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 Write it on your platform everywhere. Write it. Lord, deliver me from the little foxes. Deliver me. That thing in my life that is not of God, that is contending answers. I have prayed and prayed. I'm not seeing the answers I expect. And I desire because of these foxes in my life. Father, deliver me from them. These foxes you are not happy about. I may know them, I may not know them. Deliver me, Lord. 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 Oh, Rabaka Silemondras. Deliver me from the little foxes. Lord, deliver me from the little foxes. We're going to shout it loud and Lord, deliver me from the little foxes. Number one. Lord, deliver me from the little foxes. Shout it again. Lord, deliver me from the little foxes. Shout it again. Lord, deliver me from the little foxes. Shout it again. Lord, deliver me from the little foxes. Shout it again. Lord, deliver me from the little foxes. Shout it again. Lord, deliver me from the little foxes. Shout it again. Lord, deliver me from the little foxes. Shout it again. Lord, deliver me from the little foxes. Shout it again. Lord, deliver me from the little foxes. Shout it again. Lord, deliver me from the little foxes. Shout it again. Lord, deliver me from the little foxes. Shout it again. Lord, deliver me from the little foxes. Shout it again. Lord, deliver me from the little foxes. Yeah, 
I decree upon your life today by the power of the Holy Spirit every little fox whatever is in your life domiciled that thing that grieves the spirit that thing that pricks the Lord in your life in your speech in your words in your attitude in your character in your statements in your thoughts that makes God unhappy with you that turns away the eyes of God from you that makes the angels helpless and powerless may God take it away in the name of Jesus Amen. Amen. may God take it away in the name of Jesus Amen. Amen. may the fullness of God's plan the fullness of God's purity the fullness of God's holiness righteousness right standing may your garment become white and your head lack no ointment may you be spotless from the world preserved blameless without blemish wrinkle or any such thing the Lord purify you and sanctify you through his truth for his word is truth may he keep you unspotted from the world in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ Amen. Amen. receive that grace now Someone is supposed to have a heart surgery. The Lord says, I should tell you right now, as we are talking, the Lord is handling it. An open heart surgery. The Lord is saying, is taking care of your heart. Brand new heart. He's giving you a brand new heart now. Brand new heart. A miracle is taking place. The Lord is doing it. He's doing it. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Kobaranasata. Beruta Kalasi Gebelidas. Someone who has not been able to pass out urine. I don't know what attack that is. It's like an obstruction. You have to use a pipe to get out urine from you. But right now, I decree the passageway is open. It's open. By the hand of the Almighty, be healed in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. Touch the like button and begin to share the link. Right now, share the link. Share the link. There is power right now flowing and, and canceling medical reports, deadly medical reports. Those cases, the doctors have written you off. God is handling it now. The doctors have given you up to die. I command the yoke of infirmity that terminal disease cancer growth that virus come out in the name of Jesus Amen. Amen. that you be totally whole made whole healed in the name of Jesus Amen. Amen. right now be healed be healed in Jesus name Amen, Amen. Songs of Solomon chapter 2 and verse 4. Hmm. He brought me into the banqueting house. His banner over me, over me was love. Lord, by your love, 
ushered me to my place of celebration. He brought me into the banqueting house. Hey, someone is entering the banqueting house. Someone is entering celebration. Someone is entering celebration. Someone is entering celebration. This December is without disaster. This December shall be the best for you. Someone is entering celebration. God is ushering you to your place of celebration. He's ushering you to the banqueting house. God is ushering you to the banqueting house. He's ushering you to the banqueting house. He's ushering you to the banqueting house. He's usher you to the banqueting house hey usher me to my place lord by your love lord by your love lord by your love usher me to my place of celebration lord by your love usher me to my place of celebration he brought me into the banqueting house for his banner over me was love Lord, by your love, usher me into my place of celebration. Say, my father, my father. My, my father, father, my father. Shout it louder. My, my father, my father. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Jesus. As I begin to pray. As I begin to, to pray. pray. Lord, by your love. 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 Usher me to my place of celebration. 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 Lord, by your love. 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 Usher me to my place of celebration. 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 Lord, by your love. 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 Lord, by your love, Lord, show me to my place of celebration. 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 Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
Father, in the name of Jesus. Father, in the name of Jesus. Amen. Father, in the name of Jesus. Amen. Father, in the name of Jesus. Amen. We come to you today. And we decree that by your love, usher us into the place of celebration. Take us to the place of rest. Take us to the place of jubilation. The place of a new beginning turn around. Take us to that place. We decree every little fox in our life whatever is inside us spiritually whatever is around us physically that you are not happy you constantly frown out father take it away take it away take it away in the name of the lord jesus christ Amen. Amen. there's a sports person who just sprained the ankle the lord is healing you right now there's someone your last name is taylor you are liberian You've been having this problem running through the life of your family members. The same evil pattern of not ending well. Today, that yoke is broken from your life and from everyone coming after you in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. I hear a name like Andrew Iramoselli. Andrew Iramoselli. The Lord is showing me something now. He's saying your family, anytime they get close to something good, something bad happens. And it takes them back to square one. Sometimes they will so go back, they will empty all that they have before they will try to want to come forward again. Something bad will happen. They will go back, empty all they have to want to come in the name of Jesus. That pattern is broken. Amen. It's broken. Amen. Paramana crushed them. There's a lady, your name is Pastor Favor. This priest, I should tell you that for everything you have, that for everything you have lost, in the year 2024, it's going to bring double. It's going to make your life beautiful. It's going to give you peace. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. I see a woman, you are watching me from South Africa. You are worried concerning your son. So worried about your son. The Lord said, I should tell you not to worry. Because help is coming. The help that you will you, you break down, so surprised, in tears of joy, a supernatural help that will bring a shift that would change the trajectory of his life is happening right now in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. There's a youth couple watching me, NYSC member. You are sick, very sick. The healing power of God is even affecting your skin. The healing power of God is touching you in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. If you are sick in body, put your left hand on that spot. Si vous êtes malade, mettez votre main gauche. And stretch your right hand. Étendez l'autre main vers moi. I command sickness to go. Je commande la maladie de partir. Someone is a disease on the neck. Quelqu'un a une maladie au cou. A coup. swollen neck like goiter. Et votre cou est gonflé. Dissolve. Que cela se dissout. Let the neck come to normal size. Que cela revienne à la normale. Someone has a growth. Quelqu'un a une tumeur. By the side of the ankle. Au niveau. The growth has disappeared. Cela disparaît. There's someone you have an addiction, you inject yourself. Vous avez une addiction, vous it's a kind of thing you take. If you don't take it, you can't calm down. Si vous ne prenez pas, vous n'êtes pas à l'aise. You're addicted to it. Some kind addicted. of pill. You have to inject yourself. Et vous avez besoin d'injecter. I command. Je commande. That addiction. Que cette addiction. Break in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. May you be totally free. Que vous soyez totalement libre. And healed. Et guéri. 
in Jesus name Amen. 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 Amen your time has come Amen. Amen God bless you your prayers are answered in Jesus name Amen, Amen. let's take our offering right now thank you for joining us in prayer and may the Lord answer you according to your heart desires in Jesus name Amen Please do well to hit the like button and also subscribe for more.